Ladies and gentlemen, the popo is back, baby. Okay, so after being how long? Almost two weeks gone. We're back at it again, uh, or maybe maybe a month gone from playing this game and yes we're back playing LA Noir so first and foremost why is my thing in window I just realized hold on okay so ladies and gentlemen we are back at it again and hold on I'm fixing my camera there we go so yes we're back in LA Noir it's been so long ever since we played this game and I think we already played um what you call that again we already played the driver's seat and I'ma search it up okay so I searched it up and it says the next episode is is called the console's car and wow okay this is the console's car we are back so Today, we're playing this. There you go. Okay. It's been a while since I've played our save. Uh, the console's car. Yep. Okay, we're gonna keep this short. I'm already late for the DA. First up, Phelps, Bukowski. We got a report of a brand new Packard abandoned in an empty lot off 2nd Street between Olive and Grand. PR is one Oswald Jacobs says the vehicle was dumped in his backyard. There's a patrolman on site. Get down there and see what you can turn up. Any questions? Good. Get going. <laughs> Get going. Better go earn our pathetic wages. Yep. Let's go. It's been Rinsky, a while. It's been a while since we played rack. this. An abandoned vehicle. Is it tab? Yeah, there you go. Tab is for the. Sounds like there's more to notebook. it. Notebook. Nobody dumps a shiny new Packard unless they borrowed it without asking. You don't say. You're on fire. Where now. is the ah? Uh, there Very go. funny. <laughs> Come on, my intense protege. Let's go save the world. I will go. Ooh, let's go. Okay, so brought in Seattle, threw him out. Wife says she's gonna take him back. Women generally show more compassion. What are you talking about? Adrian dumped on her. He was humping the secretary. What? Or she shows some pride. Pride comes before a fall, Lukowski. Talking from experience. Hold on. Okay, I remember Adrian. He was in the last case. The dude that faked his death. There we go. Okay, where is this? Oh, it's at the top. What the hell? Oh my god. Hold on. Okay. It's been a while. I'm I've been rusty, okay? It's been it's been a while since I played LA Noir. And oh yeah, by the way, I have I have bought uh, GTA 4. So if you guys want me to play that game, I'll, of course, of course, I'll play that game. Where am I going now? Where in the hell am I going? Hold on, I am so lost. I think it's going up. I'll just drive here. Ah, this is a mistake. I'll probably just cut this part. <laughs> oh my god, foolishness. Uh, I think we need we have to be ah uh, this is stupid this is stupid we're the police we're the popo are you fine I am sorry okay jeez it's been a while since I've drove come on let's go and if you're wondering yes I'm high let's go oh hell yeah baby okay I am sorry for that I'll just pay for that later 
Now I'll just go here. I think we can go here. We can. Where are we? Are we here? Holy moly, it's over here. There we go. We're back. Let's go. Jacob's backyard. Phelps, traffic. I'm Officer Houlihan. Cars down the alleyway, detectives. Hmm. We got a call about an abandoned vehicle? Yes, sir. The car has flags. Might be some kind of diplomatic vehicle. Has anyone touched this vehicle since you arrived? No. And that Jacob's bird over there was on station before I got here. We'll talk with him in a moment. Mm. Give us some time to look the place over. Sure, take your time. He's a sore-headed old son of a bitch anyway. Huh. <laughs> okay. Okay. First things first. We need to search for so I need to look. Where should we go first? That's there's the A, so we gotta go to A here. How do you E? Okay. I'm sorry, I forgot the controls. <laughs> okay, so I searched it up. Like there we go. Ooh. So California Motor Vehicle. By the Argentinian Embassy. Oh. Argent what? Hold on, okay. California Motor Vehicle Registration Certificate. The motor vehicle described as shown here on is hereby registered for use and operation in accordance with the provisions of the Vehicles and Highway Traffic Act until March 31, 1948. Whoa, that's my birthday! <laughs> March 31! Hey! Okay. Okay, register the plate number PR706. Registration fee fifteen plus fifteen dollars. Uh, what's this? License fee received L. Davis, Los Angeles, January third, nineteen ninety two. Consultant with Argentina Suite. Ooh. Okay. Okay. So that's the that's the uh the steering wheel. I see the B over here. Can we can we check? Oh, there we go. What the hell? Where's the plate? Where's the... Where's the plate? Oh, that's weird. Where in the hell is the plate? What's this? Stealing the wheels is for amateurs. The car ring would have stripped it in a warehouse. Hmm. So it's been removed. That's odd. Ooh. But why is there a um hold on, I'm sorry for clicking that, but look! Another flag is gone. See if we ever look. We couldn't even look. Can we use I? Intuition? No? Let me look at the back. Empty. Oh. That's odd. What is this? Hey. Oh, you can see that. I must have taken the flag as a souvenir. Can't have any street value. Left wheel. Hmm. So if that's that's weird. Who does this? That's weird. The wheel is gone. And then... Huh? Okay. Okay. Where can we go? Can we... That's a bat. That over there is a bat. That's a bat. Doesn't tell me anything. That's even a bat. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's not. Okay. It's not a bat. Who is this? Hold on. Is this... Okay, so what is this? How do we... Why is there like... Oh, 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 I found it, I found it, hold on. 
Look, there it is. Wrench. Must have used it to remove the wheel lugs. Wheel lugs and maybe the flag? The Dewey Bros. Dewey Bros. I saw that. Well, hold on. Look, the Dewey Bros. See? Property by the Dewey Bros. I think that's it. Hold on. The people. Oswald Jacobs. Oswald Jacobs, sex male. Reporting witness at the crime scene. So there's no other... Mm. So the clues are just... Uh, abandoned vehicle. Vehicle found abandoned in empty lot. So registry. Okay, sorry. Anyway, uh, registration slip. Abandoned vehicle registered to Argentinian consulate. So it's a consulate, huh? Argentinian. Okay, so missing license plates. License plates PR seven o seven o six maybe seven o G. Removed from abandoned diplomatic vehicle. Missing wheel. Front we front right wheel removed from abandoned vehicle. That's another that's odd. Oh dumb. Oh. So I I clicked it again? I thought I moved it. Okay, missing Argentinian flag. Diplomatic flag from abandoned park park Packard. Sorry. Dewey Bros wrench. 3 4 French Mark Dewey Bros found near abandoned vehicle. The, the, the tool that was used to remove the. Um, the. What you call that again? The. The wheel. There we go. I'm sorry. So, anyway, I think. Knowing that we already have a witness over there, I think. Yeah, over there. We I think we have to ask. I think it's done. Is it done? Do you have to check anywhere? What's this? Nothing special. Something hiding here. You have to look around. What's that? What is this over here? What is this? Oh, what is this? Phelps, badge 1247. Whoa. How can I help, detective? Could you run the name Dewey Brothers? Possibly oh. a dealership or car mechanics workshop. One moment. Oh, oh, oh crap, Dewey I Brothers did. Brothers Packard Dealership, 629 Figueroa Street. Got it. Thanks for your help. Oh. Okay, so that was a good thing to do. I asked. Thank goodness I saw this. It's just bright red blue. Yeah, it's bright blue. Okay, let's ask. I don't know. Okay, so now Oswald we have to ask. Jacobs? That's right. What exactly happened here, Mr. Jacobs? Last night, I was looking out of my window. I like to keep an eye on what's going on. I can understand that. You see this empty lot? Damn kids play stickball here. Always breaking my windows. Always asking for their ball back. Can we get back to the car, Mr. Jacobs? Don't be impatient, Sonny. Anyways, last night I see this brand spanking new Packard up on bricks. Ah, okay. So that's... Ah, okay. Let's observe. Hmm. Old man. Anyway, witness report. Did you see who report. stole the Packard? Hell yes, I did. I saw three goddamn Mexicans going to work on it. Whoa. Huh? That's Mexicans. Okay. Can you tell us what they were doing? Using the headlights of an old Ford so they could strip the thing. I yelled out to them, I'll call the cops. So they loaded up their car and drove off, tooting and hollering and yelling obscenities at me in Mexican. You speak Spanish, sir? No, I do not. Ah, oh. okay. I think, uh, I don't... Hmm, let's go. Hispanic. After the uh, Mexican Hisp left, you didn't go anywhere near the car? After I scared him off? No, I didn't go anywhere near that car. Hold on. It's, hmm, that's impossible. So, let's think about it. If, 
if he see is seen a car like that, it's a, he. If that's impossible, he he did not come near that car. Let's be honest. If you see that something, some folks would probably just call the cops instantly. But this one, I think he, he looks like he's the type of person who checks. You know, he checks out the the oh, sorry, he checks out the car. You know what happened to it? That's that's to like doubt. You went out to the car. Once they were gone, you had to take a look for yourself. I hmm. was curious. See, Feel there we go. Against that. So what if I took a look around that car? You can't be accusing me of nothing. Hmm. Nah, bruh. Don't do that. Tell me about the car they were driving. Okay. It was an old Ford. I didn't catch the license number. Hmm. Okay. So, it doesn't make sense. Does it? And he did not cut the license plate. Let's think about it. Should we doubt? Or should we... That's the truth? Hmm. You know what? I think that's the truth. Because, number one... It's hard to check or it's... I don't know. I want to doubt it though. Ah, uh, nuts. I don't know. Fine. I'll go truth. You look like the kind of guy who notices details. You're right there. The car was old, but it looked brand new. Candy apple red paint job stands out a mile. Huh. Okay, so candy up pinched up. What the hell does that mean? What does that mean? Hmm. Okay. Vehicle stripped of part. What exactly did you see them take? They was working on the tires. That's all that was took. Are you sure? Wait, the tires? How about the flag? Right. So what did you take, Jacobs? Do you want my partner to pat you down? Oh. I found a notebook in the glove compartment. I was going to oh. show you. It's on the chair on my porch. Oh. Thank you for your help, Mr. Jacobs. You can speak to Officer Tabo about signing a formal statement. When you get the car out of the way, oh, you hell can yeah. come back and do something about those kids. How about we bring you an umpire's mask? <laughs> a what? Umpire's mask. Okay. Let's take this. 1947 Argent Agenda 1 Francisco Valdez. Okay. So that was neat. I got it all right, but it's my hands. It's too it's too simple. He's like those typical old men who who um who sees something probably scared him off and then he probably gonna check it out and then he sees something valuable he probably take it yeah, it's just uh typical people sometimes whoa whoa john okay, madsen so the owner of the vehicle a degenerate i'll run john madsen by r and i a uh, john madsen oh william dewey Contact details on a William Dewey. This looks like business rather than pleasure. Hmm. Okay, so... Okay. And we... Is it done? Is it all done? Like... Did I get everything? Hold on. Let, it's this. There's a thing that popped up here. The Central Police Station. Let's check. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. How can I help, detective? Can you put me through to Michigan 2458, please? Oh. Connecting you now. Okay. We're, con we're contacting something? Or someone? Hello, can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Can I speak to John Madsen, please? He's at school, officer. Uh, what's this about? Is he in trouble? How old is your boy, ma'am? Just turned 16. Oh. Wrong person, Mrs. Madsen. Sorry to disturb you. Ooh. Messages, please. There's just one message for you, Detective. A four-door Packard diplomatic license number, Paul Robert 706, was reported missing this morning by Juan Francisco Valdez. 
Oh, you haven't brought that's in. the same guy. He's already here at Central, Detective. Oh. He's demanding an audience, as he calls it. An audience. Thanks. Can you get a message to Captain Leary? Tell him we'll be in as soon as we can. Thanks, ma'am. That's okay. Now we have to interview. Can you cordon off this lot until we have the vehicle impounded? Yes, sir, Detective. Okay. We'll follow up on the owner. Get a statement from Jacobs, and I'll read your report back at the station. Okay. We can visit the Packard dealership or head back to Central and interview this Valdez character. I call. I think. Ah, oh, actually. How do you? You drive. Oh, there you go. go. Just the long, pla long. Fine. Press. Where are we headed? Ah, uh, I don't know. Let's go. Do we bros dealership? Or let you know what? I want to talk that about this guy. Yeah. Let's go. This has got to be the fiftieth abandoned vehicle call we have caught this year. One more, and I'm gonna go crazy. <laughs> Not your favorite cases? You kidding me? This is barely even police work. Of all the bad guys in this city, we get lumped with the ones who can't even be bothered to keep what they steal. <laughs> nice. My partner's just mad. He's just bored out. <laughs> so much missing car reports. I want a murder. A real one. A real murder. Hello. We have a Juan Francisco Valdez in for questioning. Sure do, Phelps. Your bird's in interview, too. And get this, he's wearing gloves and doing his best not to touch anything. Can you beat that? <laughs> Sounds like we don't want to keep this guy waiting. It's this way. Okay. Put him down with my sap. Where are we going? They say we must in there to find the goddamn ethics. Ah. Uh. Time. Are you the senior officer I requested? I'm Detective Phelps, and this is Detective Bukowski. Have you any idea how long I've been waiting to speak with you? I am needed back at the consulate, and you keep me here like a common criminal. All right, friend. Let's take a deep breath and start all over again. Mr. <laughs> Baldez. Counsel General. I insist on my full title. This guy's a... This guy's a dick. <laughs> like, what the hell? Okay. Back to him first. Hmm. He's a bad man. Okay, Packard purchase history. Where did you purchase the car? My secretary and driver arranged the purchase. A disreputable place, a Dewey Brothers by name. As soon as I can have it arranged, I will have my Hispano Suiza brought up from Buenos Aires. Okay, um, I just don't know. <laughs> uh, uh, is he lying? Is it the truth? I want to use intuition. Uh, remove an answer. Yeah. Oh my god, it's truth or doubt. I don't know. But he spoke a little bit weird earlier, so it's not a lie. I think that's any not I'll doubt it. Doubt them. Bought a Packard, Valez? A snob like you doesn't drive an American car. I want answers or I'll smack you around the teeth. William Dewey offered me a substantial bribe to make mm -hmm. a purchase at his establishment. Okay. It is not unusual to make this kind of transaction in the mm -hmm. civil service. Don't tell that to the Argentine taxpayers. Oh. Oh. Mm. Hmm. Theft or con of consular car. Oh, is it theft? You're a thief. You know what? Let's check. Consul General, we have located your car. Can you tell us how it was stolen? It must have been stolen from the consul garage. Terribly inconvenient, of course. I want the perpetrator soundly flogged. Unfortunately, we don't do that here, your worship. The way he spoke there is weird. I want to... I want to doubt him again. You know what? I just doubt him again. I just... I want to piss him off. <laughs> I just want to piss him off. You have a pretty good idea who stole oh, the car. Oh, was, was it right? Did I... Are you gonna tell me? Or do I shake it out of you? Ooh. There's no call for violence. I suspect a disgruntled boy from the car dealership. Huh? You have a name for this kid? Gabriel, like the Archangel. I have no surname. 
Associate, association with Gabriel. So tell us about this kid, Gabriel. You had a run-in with him? Mechanico. A presumptuous young man who did not know his place. He presumed to ask me questions. We do a lot of presuming here in the United States, Consul General. It comes with the turf. I don't know. Is it the truth? Is it the truth or is it gonna be a doubt? I want to doubt though. But the way he sp look, look, look. He's not looking at me straight ahead. Is he lying or something? Is he lying? This game says you have to check the facial facial expressions of uh, people that you interrogate. You know what? It's it's a lie. He, he's not looking at me. Yeah, he's just looking you around. You boys, Valdez. Are you a madman? Whoa! This will cause an international incident. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold on. Valdez? Notebook? Hmm, let's see. Valdez. Danny, oh, Ben, oh. Miguel, Tristan, and Teddy. Full lips. Ring me bells. I'm sure we can come to some arrangement. Gabriel, spill it. A beautiful but impertinent boy. <laughs> oh I my god! I and the young man went quite insane. I thought he was going to kill me. So the notebook that we saw. We'll be in touch. Oh, hell yeah. Three and three, baby. So, okay. Okay, stop. So, the reason why I chose the notebook that quick is because that's the only uh, that's the only thing that has like a lot of names. I, m I saw some names and there are like weird names. I didn't know. I thought it was for business, but that's... Damn. Damn. Damn, Mr. Wan. Damn. Okay. Me at the grand jury, Ink was thrown out. Yeah, let's just go. Let's go, mister. Go, but Botowski, Botowski finished with Valdez. Thank God, I'll get rid of him in a couple of hours. <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, you drive, you know the way, you can drive. And where exactly are we going? Dewey Bros. The Packer Dealership. Mr. Valdez moves in some peculiar circles for an international bon vivant. Ah, English, please. See, this is why nobody invites you out for drinks. It's just very industrious of him to be so involved in matters of consular transportation. All right, we're making it worse now. I think what you're trying to say is that lover boy in there is as full of crap as a Christmas goose. That is what. <laughs> true. True. Golly, that guy is having fun. Nah. Nah, he's having fun with the boys, boy. <laughs> okay. The bros dealership. Oh, wait. That dealership looks so similar. Familiar to me. I don't know. Don't tell me, let me guess. You were making your way past the lot, caught sight of the new model four door, and couldn't help yourself. You could see yourself in that car and just had to take a closer look. Well, I can't say as I blame you. <laughs> Is that guy LAPD, William Mac, Dewey? We'd like to speak with the owner. That's me, William Dewey, proprietor at your Oh, service. it's William Dewey. We're investigating the theft of a Packard belonging to the Argentine Embassy. Are you missing a combination wrench? I don't know, Detective. But I know how we can find out. Follow me. Okay, so it's uh... That's this is the uh... William Dewey guy. Mind if we look around? Be my guest! Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at this. You there sure you go. guys aren't interested in a new car? Huh? Maybe a used car. I have some nice used cars for guys in your wage bracket. William Dewey, shut the hell up. Okay, let me check. Give us some check. alone time, Dewey. Go sell some cars or whatever it is that you do here. 
<laughs> okay, let me see. Um, I want to check if if we can. We can probably check the wrench. Oh, it's three point four. Oh, three four. Okay, so I saw the three four earlier. So I think what's this? Ah, I have to. Uh, maybe this is the one half. There we go. That's one half. This is three eight. I think this is more. Nope. No, 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 got it. Right. There we go. Uh, so, you know, you know, no. get this. I think the. I think. Okay, so hold on. Let me check again. I think the wrench has a red part in it. Hold on, sorry, not the not the Argentinian flag. Uh, Mark Dewey, bro, found near abandoned. And there we go. There's there's that st strip thing. Earlier, I saw it's red, so maybe it's the red side. Let me just put 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 away this other wrenches. I think this is the one. Oh no, let me. Wrong size. Okay, it's, this that's one. one left. And that is over here. There we go. Gabriel Delgado is missing a three-quarter. Oh, there's the names. There's the names. Gabriel Delgado. Okay, that's uh, that's neat. Who are you, first and foremost? Who are you? Hey, hey, partner, come on. We need to investigate. We need to. I don't. I don't know what to do. I think we have to talk to Dewey. Hey, hey, hey. If you don't mind, we have a few questions. There we go. Okay, association with with Valdez. Packers are great cars, but this doesn't look like the kind of place favored by foreign embassies. How do you know about this? I don't know Valdez. The embassy bought the car. All I know is he must know a quality car when he sees one. Hold on. Wait, let me... Hold on, I need to check my notebook. Um, where's the notebook? Oh, alleged bri- Oh, there's the alleged bribery! Look! Well, this testifies to accepting bribes during transactions with William Dewey. Oh, there we go. So, I think what he said is a lie. And I know a shyster when I see one. You and Valdez are in this together. Me and Valdez? I hardly know him. Valdez wouldn't wipe his shoes with me. It's the it's this it's the bribery, yes yeah, the bribery. We've talked to Valdez. He was very obliging. He told us all about the arrangement the two of you had. And now quit wasting our time. Okay. So I met Valdez in a bar. We cut mm. a deal. He bought the car through the embassy. I cut him some change on the side. It happens all the time. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's a check. Whereabouts of Delgado? Where can we find Delgado? I don't know. He sure as hell isn't here. You, he works for you. Does he have like a, uh, you know what? Address, no. Dewey. Or my partner shoves her head in a car door. Okay, all right. There we go. Apartment 3, 103 Hill Street. And tell him from me. If he ever shows his face around here again, I'm going to kick his butt from here to kingdom come. Hmm. Okay. So we are going to investigate Delgado's residence. The wrench used in auto thief. A wrench from this dealership was used to strip the wheels from a Packard last night, mm -hmm. Mr. Dewey. A couple of Hispanics were seen taking parts. We've had a spate of thefts ourselves. Comes with the location. Even bastards to steal anything the minute your back is turned. So if that's... Hmm. You know what? Now. What are you hiding, Dewey? Spill it! You don't want the LAPD getting too interested in this place. So I hire a few illegals. It's cheaper than oh, he hired GIs, okay. and they have less attitude. Downside is, they're a little light-fingered. Thank you for your help, Mr. Dewey. No problem. God damn that kid! I'm just an honest car salesman. 
Seems like you just don't know who you can trust these days. Going to movies, Dewey. You're missing your calling. Time to visit Gabriel Delgado. See how good his excuse is. Yeah, sure, come to me. Can I talk to you? Friend. Nope, we can't. Why is he just walking at the back? Okay. We're going to the Delgado boy. Let's go! <clears throat> okay, so I think... You're behind the wheel. Oh, he already sat. Alright, where to? Delgado's residence. Sorry, I don't want to drive. <laughs> Let's go. You read the story in the Examiner about the Navy developing three-dimensional movies? What's a dimension? You know, like a graph. Vertical axis is Y and horizontal is X. Well, that's clear as mud. Third dimension would be Z. So, things would be popping out of the screen. That's ridiculous. Scare people out of the theater. God's oh. name would want that. Oh. I don't know. People uh. scoffed at the idea of talking. Oh, color. they're what talking about now? 3D. That's so cool that they're talking about 3D at this time period. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Delgado's residence. Okay. Let's go. Okay, let's see what Gabriel has to say for himself. I just hope our Archangel hasn't already flown. Hey. Sorry. Hmm. Ow. Knock. You have to. Oh, it's. What's this? Is there is this the uh where do you see a number three marked on that door? Oh sorry, sorry, it's a tree. Oh there we go. Yet yeah. LAPD ma'am. We're looking for Gabriel Delgado. Gabriel? We're from the police. Policia, you understand? Yes. I understand. <laughs> Would you come inside? What is your name? Ana Rodriguez. Is Gabriel Delgado here, Ms. Rodriguez? No. What do you want with Gabriel? Is he in trouble? Stay where you are, Ms. Rodriguez. We need to take a look around. But he is not here. I have told you. Check out the surrounds. I'll stay with the broad. Whoa. Okay. Um, oh, hi. Flag. So how far along are you, Anna? Flag. Flag. Nearly 20 weeks. Right. So how's it gonna be when Two you go into the labor and he's not around? Oh my god. You are wrong about Gabriel. He will be a good father. Oh, uh, what's this? Already he works hard to provide for us. Doesn't look like anything. The Unless you Bible. help us here, Anna, your little one won't be seeing Papa for a very long time. Whoa, whoa, shut up, shut up. Don't say that. What's this? And I think that's just a normal book. Hey, no, not yet. Don't talk. No, I'm not wanna talk. I need to search evidence. No, is there any evidence here? I don't want to. I don't want to talk. Hold on. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, my girlfriend just messaged me. Okay. Um. The 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 water, please, Jesus. Uh. Let me check. Serving breakfast for two, Anna? You should have cleared up. Ah, so he was here. I think he's just hiding. I think he's hi- uh, sorry, sorry. I think he's just hiding. No, we can go out. Ah, that's cool. Uh, can we check the fridge? No. Oh, there's a photo. What's this? Difficult to tell whether it's the suspect vehicle from the scene. I think you real pride and joy. I think that's I think that the uh, that's the guy you think. Okay, let's check outside. Oh, this is beautiful. The backyard and there's a shed. I think that guy is hiding there. I think. What it, guys, if Gabriel's there, I'll call for it. Oh, okay. 
nothing suspicious. What's this? Whoa! What's this? Diplomatic. Oh, license. it is. It is PR seven oh six. Oh, it's the is the plate. It's here. What's that? What's this over here? What is this? Incidental. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Whoa, hold on. Why can I move? Okay, sorry, I couldn't move. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, a Packard. Look. It looks like Valdez gets his wheel back. Look, the Packard. Okay, so... I think we are now going back. I think we're done. Do we, can we, can we use, and then we can't just even use intuition. I think we're done. We just saw most of the evidence needed. I think. Okay. Okay, can we go check this room? No? This room over here. Nope. Okay. Let's talk. Can we talk? You're in serious trouble. Miss Rodriguez. But Gabriel is not here. I have done nothing wrong. Okay. Motive for auto. Why did he steal the car, Anna? The customer insulted him. He has his honor, no? No. Okay. Okay. Is it true? His honor, Anna? He said Dewey's friend tried to make a woman out of him. He no longer respects this man, Dewey. He took the car to show this maricon that he is a man. Okay, that's the truth. Um, hmm, you know what? Let's contact with Gabriel. We can we can probably push this. Tell I think he's truth, going. Man. She's going to lie about Has this. Has Gabriel been here? I haven't seen him for. There we go. She lied. Nights. She lied. The 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 plates. The plates is still there. That's impossible. Yeah, she lied. You keep lying to me. And I'll send you and your baby to jail. Oh. He lives here, but he hasn't come home. There we go. I swear it. Are you sure? But why does it have like the stolen stolen flag there? I could use that too. Or maybe I could use this. You know what? This is way better. Enough, nice. Anna. There are signs all over this place that he's been back. Mm-hmm. Got him. Got him. He was here last night. Mm -hmm. I have never seen him so angry. He went out to his shed and put some things in it. I don't know what and I don't want to know. I love him. Are you sure? Okay, the, the diplomatic plates are covered. We found a license plate matching our stolen vehicle in the shed. Uh -huh. Added the assortment of parts and we can make Gabriel for a dozen other thefts. It's time to get serious, Anna. You must ask these questions of Gabriel. I know nothing of these car parts. Are you sure? Why is there a lot though? That doubt that. I doubt then that. Then tell us where he is. If your baby is born in prison, Anna, the corrections officers will take it from you. You will see your son or daughter through a metal grate for half an hour a week. The start line is on First and Santa Fe. Oh. <gasps> there is a spillway under the bridge that I got her. to the river. There we go. I got her. Many policia have wrecked trying to follow him. We will put in a good word. There we go. She had a three yet again. Sits with Gabriel. Starline. That sounds like a street race to me. Yep. It's gotten out of hand this last year. There we go. I wonder Delgado has such an eye for final. Is let's go stop these clowns and get them off the streets. Okay. Okay, Badowski, let's go. Isn't he the cop they've been talking about? On the Shut road? up! You kept on talking about me. What another accommodation? Man, illegal street race. Are we going to race? Nah. Oh, not this part. Not this. What kind of man leaves his pregnant girlfriend at home while he goes off to play cards? Pregnant girlfriends aren't always a barrel of laughs. Everyone used to let off a little steam. Some guys wouldn't come back home at all. Are you talking from experience? 
<laughs> oh my god. Are you talking like about experience? Another one springs up somewhere else. The kids used to steal cars to sell them. Now they just want to wrap them around a lamp. The next 16 year old I have to peel off the sidewalk, you're called. Me. I've had enough of those to last me a lifetime. All units of 459 just occurred at 6 and Sarah's. Any unit to handle, come to identify. I'm sorry, I couldn't. I have a mission. Jesus, that guy is just running. I don't drive. I'm looking at the map. The Popo is here. Let's go. The Popo. Ah, uh, traffic. Move. With the Popo, we're important. Uh, uh, uh you know what? Screw it. Screw it. Screw it. Start cut. Did they kill a bird? What was that? There we go. Got you now. Whoa, what was that? There's the red Ford. That's still got him right there. Look. Quick, they're getting away. Phelps, 1247. Requesting Whoa. assistance at first at Santa Fe. That disappeared. Just of an illegal street. Stay on the Oh, I hope this is uh you're lucky this is not GDA. Is this one? okay this oh man man that car that car just smashed into me Nah that car just the car Delgado is our boy get the other There we go. There we go. Beautiful. Whoa! Get in the way. We're in the swamp. I mean, no, no, no. This is not. Let him do his wheel arches. Come on. Step on it, Bell. Take him out. Ma. 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 Enough games, Phelps. Take this guy out. I know! Hold on! No way, it's it broken. It's broken! Him. It broke. God damn it, Cole! Hold it steady! The car broke! The car broke! Wait, did they lose it? Did they lose it? Did I? You, you, no, 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 no. Oh God, I thought. No, 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 no. There's the red Ford. That still got him right there. No, I thought I lost it. Ah, uh, that is just that's that was that was the worst turn. That was a bad turn. But this one. I can manage. Enough games, Phelps. Take this guy out. I tall I got. Step on it, Phelps. Take him out. Come on. Lay into his wheel arches. Come on. That was horrible. Damn it, Cole, hold it steady. Got him. Got him there. Hey. Delgado, Ooh. Ooh. Grand Theft Auto. Ooh. Grand Theft Auto. Let's Fuck go. Fuck you, puto. You should speak to the maricón. Valdez, I showed him. Now who's a man? I should have burned his fucking car. Ooh. 
Let's go. You got a foreign dignitary outed as a fruit and a kitty raper, a car dealer we're gonna let slide for the kickbacks, and a street punk car thief who sure as hell won't be taking liberties with other people's autos again anytime soon. Yeah. That Detective Phelps is not a bad haul. You keep your chin low and your hands high, and you keep bringing me clearances just like that one. That's textbook policing, and we need more of it in this department. Yeah. yeah let's go. Yeah, let's go. We did it. Oh, yes. Finally. Perfect. Come on. That's cool. We're done. We have finished. Mm. What's next? You have Ooh. any plans for Weekend Liberty Jack? My sisters have been working in Los Angeles in a bomber factory. They're coming down to visit. I'm meeting them at the station at 6. Good for you, Jack. Are they cute? They're my sisters, Hank. Attention! Final inspection before Liberty. Ooh. Good job, Kelso. Kelso. Are we going somewhere, gentlemen? Full inspection! It had better be exceptional if any of you want liberty this weekend. Kelso, this carbine. The bore is dirty. No, it isn't. Are you arguing with me, Kelso? Do what you need to do, Sergeant. You know the bore is immaculate. Weekend liberty canceled. Two-day field drill. Oh, man. Uh... Clean this rifle. No. Do you know the penalty for insubordination, Kelso? Jack, don't do it. Forget him, Hank. He doesn't have what it takes. Are you two finished? Are you going to clean this rifle? Ah, uh, Kelso, you're an ass, bro. No, Sergeant. Cole is right. I'm going to stop playing games and join a rifle company and fight the real enemy. Oh, that's... Oh, whoa. Okay. That was something else. What the hell? Um, well, marriage, what the marriage made in heaven. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more videos like this. That this is, I think, this is episode four.